Okay, we're going to do a basic stall of homebrew and get Python 3 set up for my Mac users. So we'll open up a terminal. And we should make that a little bit bigger so you can see what's going on. And then we go to brew.sh. We copy paste this URL, or command line actually. We'll put that into the shell. It's going to let us know this is what it's going to install. This is great. And it's going to download and install Homebrew for us. This shouldn't take too long. Since we're just installing the basic package here. And that's uh, pretty well it. So there's brew help, like it says right here, if you want some more information. So we can do brew help. It lets you know what the major major commands are. Uh, brew doctor is a good thing to run when uh, it finds other software you've installed in user local that it doesn't recognize. So you can run brew doctor. Brew update is very important. So you should run this you know, every day, every week. It goes out and gets the um, information about the latest packages that are available, and then brew upgrade. And I'd run brew it upgrade right now, but there's really nothing to upgrade. So we're going to go ahead, and um, you could do a list. So I could do say, let's list the things that match Python 3. Um, there's nothing there actually. Um, I want to actually what I want to do is brew search Python 3 because I don't have Python 3 installed, I couldn't find it out, obviously. So it's gonna go out and search for anything that looks like it matches Python 3. It found one, the Python 3 binary that we do wanna install, so I'm gonna go ahead and install that now. Brew install Python 3, and then I'll just let it go. and Go get coffee while I'm waiting here. And that looks like it's done. So we should be able to test it out. Say that Python 3 minus V shows us that we're running Python 3.5.2. All's good. We could go to uh, desktop and run Python 3 on my hello.py file. And it works. Excellent. So now you're set up with your Python 3 through homebrew installation.